So we are in the powered market. Uh, this is one of the tourist attractions of Oxford. Uh, uh, this is the Oxford Cheese Company. And if you see the roof of the market, this is very distinctive. It's like uh, what we have in old markets like uh, the Hog Market or New Market in Kolkata. The covered market, which is uh, one of Oxford's tourist destinations, it was set up in 1774. Uh, it was set up because there were a lot of messy markets, farmers markets uh, all around the city and uh, this was an effort to bring it all under one roof as a produce market so that roads were cleared up and there, there, there was no mess on the streets. So uh, at that point it was a modern endeavour and uh, this market is now actually a historic place and uh, I have been coming to this market from the time I have been coming to Oxford in 2002 and uh, I always, whenever I come to Oxford, I always uh, prefer to get my supplies uh, fresh from here because we have uh, farmers who have set up their uh, little stalls here and rather than going to a supermarket, I always prefer to come here for my uh, groceries and my produce. So if you will just follow me, you can see we have uh, a fruit shop here and I'm going to buy some bananas. Uh, the fruit here is always remarkably fresh. Um, where can I buy some bananas? Hi. Hello, can I get uh, two bananas please? The smaller ones, please. These ones? These ones? Yes, please. There you go. Do you have a. Can I get one of those bags? Thank you very much. So, here are my bananas, and uh, this is the butcher shop. This is the butcher's shop. So this, as I was saying, uh, these uh, these uh, kind of stalls were scattered all around the city, and this was actually an endeavor back then in 1774 to get it all together under one roof, uh, so that the city was cleared up. And if you will uh, just follow me along this way. We have some uh, of the shops and restaurants which are very, very typical Oxford, very typical powered market. We have Pie Minister, which is the, uh, which is a shop for pies. If you like pies, uh, you can see the menu from outside. You have steak and kidney, you have chicken, ham and beef. All of this is very typically English, very typically British. So the covered market is very, very British. It's very, very English. Um, this is a chocolate shop. This is the Wicked Chocolate Shop and it's a kid's delight. It's my delight. It's everybody's delight. And uh, if you come here, the covered market is now being renovated and redone. So this is the history of covered market that I was just talking to you about. It's encapsulated here on this wall, the history of covered market. And much of it is as it was before. They're just renovating and redoing it. Covered market established in 1770 it was i think formally opened in 1774 and it, it is now one of the tourist attractions of britain of oxford so today it was the covered market and uh, on this trip of the uk when we are covering the commonwealth games we will bring you more such destinations from uh, wherever we go uh, so keep following us Keep watching us.